Let's do some acid-based chemistry at home. All you need is an egg. Any old egg will do. We just happen to have a lot of fresh eggs around here. So you need an egg and you're just gonna cover that in vinegar. This is just plain household vinegar. This bottle is a couple years old, so, but it does the job. So you're gonna cover your egg and then you're just gonna let it sit. So you're gonna wait and wait and wait. I am an impatient person. I took it out after only a day. And as you can see, not all of the eggshell has dissolved, but if you kind of rub it, you can force it to happen. So I just rinsed off what was what was left of that eggshell um, so that I was left with my rubber egg. And it's definitely fun to play with and bounce and all of that, but I'm sure you're here because you want to hear the chemistry behind this reaction, right? Yeah, okay. Anyway, that's a neutralization reaction between acetic acid, which is the main ingredient in vinegar, and the calcium carbonate in the eggshell. The bubbles that you see is the carbon dioxide that's produced, and we're also going to produce calcium acetate. It doesn't impact the inner membrane, as you can see. Um, the egg will still crack. That membrane will still crack, leaving you with the egg. Thanks to osmosis, it's just a pickled egg. What are you waiting for? Go grab an egg and see what else calcium carbonate will react with.